Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into the fascinating and sometimes terrifying world of venomous animals. We've scoured the globe to bring you a countdown of the top 10 most venomous creatures on our planet. Now, when we talk about venom, we're referring to toxins that are injected through a bite or sting, and potency is often measured by something called the LD50 the dose of venom required to kill 50% of a test population. Prepare to be amazed and maybe a little freaked out as we count down the most dangerously venomous animals on Earth. Get ready for a very lengthy and in-depth look at these incredible, albeit deadly species. Kicking off our list at number 10 is the Gila Monster, or Heloderma suspectum. Found in the southwestern United States and northwestern Mexico, the Gila monster is one of the few venomous lizards in the world. These slow-moving reptiles might look docile, but their bite can deliver a potent neurotoxin. Their venom is produced in glands in their lower jaw and is chewed into their victims. Unlike snakes that have hollow fangs, the Gila monster's grooved teeth allow the venom to seep into the wound. While their venom isn't typically fatal to healthy adult humans, it can cause excruciating pain, swelling, nausea, vomiting, and a drop in blood pressure. Cases requiring medical attention are not uncommon after a Gila monster bite. These fascinating creatures primarily feed on small mammals, birds, and eggs. They spend a significant amount of time underground, emerging to hunt. Their distinctive black and orange or pink patterns serve as a warning to potential predators. While they possess potent venom, they are generally not aggressive, and bites usually occur when they are handled or feel threatened. Remember, admire these unique lizards from a safe distance. Slithering its way to number 9 is the Inland Taipan, or Oxyuranus microlipidotus often considered the world's most venomous snake in terms of pure venom toxicity based on lab tests. Native to the semi-arid regions of Central East Australia, this snake possesses a highly potent neurotoxic venom. The LD50 of inland Taipan venom in mice is incredibly low, indicating its extreme toxicity. A single bite can contain enough venom to potentially kill dozens of adult humans. The venom primarily targets the nervous system, causing paralysis and potentially respiratory arrest. Despite its potent venom, the inland taipan is generally a shy and reclusive snake. It prefers to avoid confrontation and will typically only bite if it feels severely threatened or cornered. Fortunately, human encounters are rare due to its remote habitat. However, if a bite does occur, it is a medical emergency requiring immediate antivenom treatment. When threatened, the inland taipan may perform a striking display, involving raising its forebody in an S-shape before delivering lightning-fast strikes. Their diet mainly consists of small rodents. While incredibly venomous, their temperament means they pose less of a threat to humans compared to more aggressive snakes. At number 8, we have a seemingly innocuous but incredibly dangerous creature, the blue-ringed octopus. Found in the tide pools and shallow coral reefs of the Indo-Pacific region, these small octopuses, typically only a few centimeters in size, pack a deadly punch. They possess tetrodoxin, the same potent neurotoxin found in pufferfish. This toxin is produced by symbiotic bacteria in their salivary glands. The blue-ringed octopus delivers its venom through a painless bite. Initially, the bite may go unnoticed, but the venom quickly begins to take effect, causing muscle weakness, paralysis, and potentially respiratory failure. There is no antivenom available for blue-ringed octopus venom. The characteristic bright blue rings appear when the octopus feels threatened, serving as a warning signal. These fascinating creatures are generally docile and will only bite if they are handled or feel threatened. Their small size and relatively inconspicuous appearance can make them seem harmless, but their venom is potent enough to kill an adult human within minutes. It's crucial to observe these beautiful creatures from a distance and never attempt to touch them. 
Shelling out at number 7 is the geographic cone snail, otherwise known as Conus geographus. Found in the warm waters of the Indo-Pacific, this seemingly unassuming sea snail is one of the most venomous cone snail species. Cone snails are predatory marine gastropods that use a modified harpoon-like tooth to inject venom into their prey, which consists of small fish. The venom of the geographic cone snail is a complex cocktail of toxins, including conotoxins, that can cause rapid paralysis and even death in humans. Their harpoon is a disposable, hollow tooth connected to a venom gland. When the snail detects prey, it extends a proboscis containing the harpoon and injects the venom. A sting from a geographic cone snail can be incredibly painful, followed by numbness, tingling, muscle weakness, and potentially respiratory paralysis. There is no anti-venom available for geographic cone snail venom. The characteristic bright blue rings are highly sought after by collectors, but admiring them in their natural habitat is the safest approach. Camouflaged masters of venom take the number six spot, the stonefish, Sinensia verrucosa, and related species. Found in the shallow coastal waters of the Indo-Pacific, stonefish are masters of disguise, resembling rocks or coral. This excellent camouflage makes them particularly dangerous as unsuspecting swimmers or waders can accidentally step on them. Stonefish possess venomous spines along their back that can deliver an excruciatingly painful and potentially lethal venom. When pressure is applied to the spines, they erect and can easily penetrate skin. The venom contains a variety of toxins that cause intense pain, swelling, muscle weakness, shock, and potentially death if untreated. The pain from a stonefish sting is often described as the worst pain imaginable. Immediate medical attention is crucial and anti-venom is available. Wearing sturdy footwear when walking in shallow reef areas can significantly reduce the risk of stepping on a stonefish. Their incredible camouflage combined with their potent venom makes them a formidable and dangerous inhabitant of tropical waters. Reaching the halfway point at number five is the death stalker scorpion, Leurus quinquistriatus. Found in the arid and semi-arid regions of North Africa and the Middle East, the death stalker is considered one of the most dangerous scorpions in the world. While most scorpion stings are painful but not life-threatening to healthy adults, the Deathstalker's venom is a potent cocktail of neurotoxins and cardiotoxins. A sting from this scorpion can cause intense pain, fever, convulsions, paralysis, coma, and potentially death, especially in children, the elderly, and those with pre-existing health conditions. Despite its reputation, the Death Stalker is not particularly aggressive and will typically only sting if it feels threatened. However, its potent venom makes it a significant danger in its native habitat. Anti-venom is available and crucial for treating severe envenomations. These nocturnal predators feed on insects and other small invertebrates. Their yellowish coloration helps them blend into their sandy environment. Swinging into the number four spot is the Brazilian wandering spider, genus Phonutria, also known as the banana spider. Found in the tropical regions of Central and South America, these are large and aggressive spiders known for their potent neurotoxic venom. Their name comes from their tendency to wander into human dwellings and hide in dark places, including banana bunches, hence the nickname. Unlike many other spiders that build webs, Brazilian wandering spiders are active hunters. Their venom contains a powerful neurotoxin called PTX3, which can cause intense pain, sweating, increased heart rate, high or low blood pressure, nausea, vomiting, and in some cases, death, particularly in children. One particularly unusual effect of the venom in males is priapism, a painful and prolonged erection.
Brazilian wandering spiders are considered dangerous due to their potent venom and their tendency to be found in populated areas. If threatened, they will often rear up on their hind legs and display their fangs in a defensive posture. Bites should be treated as a medical emergency, and anti-venom is available. Entering the top three at number three is the infamous box jellyfish, class Cubozoa. Found in tropical and subtropical oceans worldwide, with particularly dangerous species inhabiting the Indo-Pacific region and Australia, box jellyfish are considered some of the most venomous marine animals on Earth. Their bell-shaped bodies can be translucent and difficult to spot on the water. Trailing from their corners are numerous tentacles armed with millions of stinging cells called nematocysts. Each nematocyst contains a barbed, venom-filled dart that is explosively discharged upon contact. The venom of some box jellyfish species, particularly Chironex fleckery, the Australian box jellyfish, is incredibly potent and can cause immediate and excruciating pain, muscle spasms, difficulty breathing, paralysis, cardiac arrest, and even death within minutes. The pain is often described as so intense that victims can go into shock and drown. Vinegar is often used as first aid treatment as it can deactivate undischarged pneumatocysts. Anti-venom is available for Chironex fleckery envenomation. Protective clothing, such as stinger suits, is recommended when swimming in areas known to have box jellyfish. Their potent venom and the speed at which it can act make them a significant threat. Striking in at number two is the King Cobra, Ophiophagus hanna. Found in the forests of Southeast Asia, this magnificent snake is the world's longest venomous snake. While its venom may not be the most potent by LD50 standards compared to some others on this list, the sheer volume of venom it can inject in a single bite makes it incredibly dangerous. The King Cobra's venom is primarily a neurotoxin that affects the central nervous system, leading to paralysis, respiratory failure, and potentially death. A single bite can deliver enough venom to kill an elephant or multiple adult humans. Despite its fearsome reputation, the King Cobra is generally a shy and non-aggressive snake that prefers to avoid confrontation. However, if threatened or provoked, it will stand its ground, raise its forebody, and spread its characteristic hood as a warning. Bites usually occur when they are disturbed. King Cobras play an important role in their ecosystem as they primarily prey on other snakes, including venomous ones. Their impressive size, potent venom yield, and iconic hood make them a truly formidable and awe-inspiring creature. Anti-venom is available for King Cobra and Venomation. And finally, taking the top spot as the most venomous animals on our list are the poison dart frogs, family Dendrobatidae. Found in the tropical rainforests of Central and South America, these small, brightly colored frogs are renowned for their incredibly potent toxins secreted through their skin. Unlike the other animals on this list that inject venom through bites or stings, poison dart frogs are poisonous to the touch. Their skin contains a variety of alkaloids, some of which are among the most toxic non-protein organic compounds known. The golden poison frog, Phyllobates terribilis, is considered the most toxic with enough toxin on its skin to kill multiple adult humans. These toxins interfere with nerve function, leading to paralysis and cardiac arrest. Indigenous people have historically used these toxins to poison the tips of their hunting darts, hence their name. The frogs themselves do not produce these toxins. They obtain them from their diet of certain ants, mites, and beetles in the wild. Frogs raised in captivity on different diets do not develop the same level of toxicity. Their bright colors serve as a warning to potential predators. It is crucial never to touch or handle poison dart frogs in the wild as even a small amount of toxin absorbed through the skin can be fatal. Their incredible toxicity makes them the undisputed number one on our list of the most venomous animals. Wow, what an incredible and intense journey into the world of venomous animals. From the lurking stonefish to the deadly poison dart frog, nature truly holds some fascinating and dangerous secrets. Which of these animals surprised you the most? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed learning about these incredible creatures, be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more amazing wildlife content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.